Kerr out. And he's one sexy leopard. Hey, baby! Yeah, you! You're looking good, baby! I'm seeing spots! Hey, here comes that Deborah chick. I hear she is wild. The elephant? You're into that? Come on, you never had the pinned in the lake fantasy? You know, I'm just here at the water's edge getting a drink. Whoops, I slipped. Or did I? Hey, guys. Hey, honey. Sorry I'm late. The compound is a madhouse. All the animals are out trying to catch a glimpse of Donkey. Donkey? You mean Donkey from Shrek? Yeah, he's in town shooting a commercial for some Japanese SUV. Donkey, please. He's no actor. He's got one move. Yeah, you want to hang out with the goofy green guy. Show us why. Make me feel something. Fat. <laughs> That's right. Run, you little wussy. I've never seen Sal this mad. <gasps> he's on the roof. Try to escape. Go, go! What's going on? Billy came to school without his protection money. Idiot. He put us all in jeopardy. Don't worry about that bully, honey. I'll talk to his mother. Great idea, Mom. He'll never get beaten for that. Hey, buddy. I'm looking forward to career day at your school tomorrow. Can't wait to meet your class and tell all your friends about what I do. You know, you don't have to come if you don't want. Hunter, what's the matter? Why don't you want Daddy to come to your school? <laughs> you see, Mom. In his class, Hunter's teetering on the cusp of loserdom. His current survival strategy is to fly under the radar. Or else draw the attention of the cool kids and risk a hot tail. What's a hot tail? Hot tail is when we used to light a match under a guy's tail. <laughs> we did it a lot, but somehow it was always fresh. Yeah, well, in his class, Hunter is that kid. I mean, if he does anything, if he enjoys his lunch too much, he gets a hot tail. How can they tell? We can tell. So, Dad, what I'm saying about career day is maybe you could just forget about it like you do with everything else. Hmm, I could. Or I could come to your school, be awesome, and make you proud. Great. <laughs> Classic. Hello, Vegas Strip. Hello, Wonderfolk. It is hello from Roy. Oh, my God! Stop the car! What is this monstrosity doing here? What happened to our favorite Applebee's? It has been destroyed to reveal this horrifically charming slice of quaint Americana. Oh, this ISO is appalling. Where's the neon? There is the reassuring corporate logo. Where is the African-American performer palatable to middle America such as Dion Warwick or Lou Rawls? These small businesses will destroy our way of life. Even the name sounds sinister. Grandma Wilson's bed und breakfast. This is wrong, and we must stop it. Not just to have something to do during the day, but to save the city we love. So, in conclusion, pick a career that suits you. Uh, Blake, there's someone here who wants to see you. His name is the MGM Lion. <laughs> Your dad knows the MGM Lion? Yep, and my mom knows Tony the Tiger. She took a nap with him. Sorry to interrupt. Just wanted to say hi to my good buddy Blake and tell you all. <laughs> So, my friend, what have you been up to? Well, I watched a movie last night and saw myself. Unfortunately, class, we have to say goodbye to Blake. Oh. I know, I know. But we asked these other parents to come, so let's just tough this out. So long, kids. Yeah. Follow that. Now, here's Larry. Hiya, kids! I'm Hunter's dad. When does it end? And I'm the lead lion in the Siegfried and Roy magic show. I thought I'd take you on a personally guided tour through my exciting day. A backstage pass to a big-time Vegas extravaganza. <clears throat> Do you know any celebrities like Blake does? Well, yeah, sure, of course. Like who? Well, I, mean, I, I, I guess you might say... Next parent, next parent, next parent, next parent, next parent, next parent. Next parent, next parent. I know Donkey. <gasps> you know Donkey? Yeah. I never told you, son, because I don't like to brag about it, but he's a close personal pal of mine. Wow, that's awesome. My dad knows the MGM Lion. Shut up. Do you and Donkey ever high five? Once in a while. But when you high five Donkey as much as I have, it gets kind of old. Usually I just go, Donkey. <gasps> Could you get Donkey to come visit our class? Visit? The class? Yeah, he's in town shooting a commercial. Yeah, Dad. And since you're such good friends with him, it would be really easy for you to bring him. 
Like Blake brought the MGM lot. Yeah, 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 hold on. Yeah, <laughs> I'm sure your teacher wouldn't want another day where her class is disrupted. Oh my God, Donkey's coming. He's so hot. <gasps> okay, I'll talk to Donkey and bring him by tomorrow. have said that. I don't know. They were hating me up there. I felt like a writer accepting an Academy Award. But Donkey, why didn't you just promise him Justin Timberlake? Is he the dudes? What's going on there? You should have seen Hunter's eyes. He was pleading with me not to let him down. I, I, I just couldn't do that to him. Larry, you have to tell Hunter the truth. Hunter, no! Yeah, that's right! What, you wussy? <laughs> Look at him. He's torturing weaker kids. I can't take that away from him. Well, eventually, they're going to find out that his dad doesn't know Donkey. W wait, wait a minute. Maybe I can do this. Donkey's staying in a bungalow at the Mirage. All I have to do is get to him, make my case, convince him to come to Hunter's school and pretend to be my friend. It's a perfect plan! You couldn't have gone out with the Lewicki kid. He beat his drinking problem, you know. Hello? Yes, he's right. Hello? <gasps> you boys looking for a room? We would like to file a complaint. Who's your parent company? Come again? What corporation owns you? Weston? Marriott? Perhaps Disney? Oh, bless your heart, no. It's just little old me. I opened this B&B with my retirement money. <laughs> this is not plastic with a flickering filament. Can I get you boys anything? A slice of my homemade pecan pie? Nein, danke, Frau Wilson. In fact, on behalf of the Las Vegas Historical Society, we demand you install air conditioning, a Wendy's featuring Krispy Kreme donuts, and delightful machines that people can put their life savings into one quarter at a time. My, you boys sure do say a lot of words in a row. If no change is made, we will be forced to stage a protest. Well, okay then, but before you go, are you sure there's nothing I can get for you boys? We got homemade ice cream. Oh, mit real chocolate chips. Don't fall for it, Ziggy. <sighs> she smells of cinnamon. Back! We won't <gasps> fall under your spell, succubus. Oh, my God. You have saved me once again, Roy. You have not heard the last of us, decrepit spellbinder. Oh, my God! It's him! It's him! Hey, looking good, Vegas. Power walking three times a week. And don't forget the floss for that killer smile. <laughs> Back freaks, this guy made 15 million for Shrek 2. Yeah, and a piece of the domestic yeah. growth. Currently under audit if DreamWorks will open a book. And security's tight. Don't worry, I'll distract him. Hey, we should take the word God out of the Pledge of Allegiance. My God, <laughs> right or wrong, love it or not. Like <laughs> Donkey, hi, I I'm Larry, star of the whole Siegfried and Roy thing. Big fan, waffles, hilarious. Look, I'm in a bind. I need you to visit my kid's school for five minutes. You're in, you're out. It really mean the world to him. Say no more, anything for a kid. Just talk to my manager, Ellen, please. She'll set the time. Hi, Larry the Lion, star of the whole Siegfried and Roy thing. Look, Donkey told me to set up a time for him to come to my kid's school. Not gonna happen. Okay, um, I talked to your manager. Seems like a lovely woman, but she was not that receptive. And it's really important to my kid. He loves you. Yeah, the kids love Donkey. You go tell I want to make this top priority. Tell I said to make it a cold green. Got it. Hi, me again. By the way, great nipples. Look, I talked to Donkey. He wants this to be top priority. Code green. Not gonna happen. Okay. Okay, I feel like I'm getting jerked around a little bit here. Larry, let me tell you about my life, okay, babe? Every day I got a million people asking, Donkey, will you come to my birthday party? Or, Donkey, can my big old fat cousin ride you? Or, Donkey, can I shave you and then rub soothing aloe all over your painful bumps? And I'd love to say yes to all my fans, but if I did that, I'd have no life. That's why I have the pig manager to say no, because saying no makes me sad, understand? Especially the children. When their eyes get big and their lips start quivering and they make that sound, you know that little children's sanity? <laughs> Don't let them cry, Larry. Don't let them cry, I just can't take it anymore. I can't take it. Stop crying, you crazy little angel. But look, Hunter's having a really hard time at school. 
See, he's a bit of a geek. But don't you think I had a hard time in school? I mean, look at me. Do you know how many times I had to hear, Dunky is an ass, Dunky is an ass? All right, I get it. They're synonyms. I hate synonyms, Larry. You know what I do love, though? Parfaits. You like parfaits, Larry? But No buts, Larry. I'm sorry. There's nothing I can do. But let your kid know that Shrek 3 is coming out in 2006. So Mom and Pop Menace is threatening the fabric of our wonderful garish community. We will not stand by and let Las Vegas become the next small town USA. I've got your main street right here. Now, we will shout angry things to which you will reply, yeah. Yeah. Grandma Wilson, we don't want to know our neighbors' names. Right, short, fat, bald guy and lady with price problem? Yeah. We already have a town square, and that is William Bennett when he comes to gamble. Yeah. If we must have a hold down, let it be a hooker who has stumbled. Yeah. Oh, you boys brought the whole gang over. Would anyone <laughs> like some lemonade? But we are protesting against your establishment. Eat that something. Yeah. And get ready for more, old lady. But first, I need to find a bathroom. You can use my bathroom, sweetheart. How can you have restroom use for non-customers? It's just the way we do things around here. I give up. You can't fight that. She is too strong. Huh. We're finished. Look at me. Even I'm taking a load off. Desperate times call for desperate measures. I am the only man who can save the city we love. Aren't you a nice boy? I thought you might like that, Grandma Wilson. So, I'll see you again Tuesday? Not so fast. If you want another slice of Siegfried pie, there are going to have to be some changes around here. Lazy days and moonlit nights. Hazy day well, I better tell Hunter the truth. God, he's going to hate me. Hey, there he is, with all those kids wearing cones. Hunter's got a crew. I'm hungry. Let's get some food. Uh, I mean, Hunter, do you want to get some food? Nah, mm, I'm not hungry. Stupid. I was just kidding. I'm not even hungry. Hey, Conehead. We asked our dad, and he said your dad doesn't even know Donkey. He's full of it. My dad wouldn't lie. He's awesome. If he says he knows Donkey, then he knows Donkey. This is a nightmare. He totally believes me. Man, if I'd have been that gullible when I was his age, I'd be sitting in a basement in the Bronx right now waiting for someone to throw me a chicken. <laughs> well, well, as much as I enjoy watching you flounder in your own stink, for the good of my grandson, I'm going to bail you out. What can you do? Donkey's already said no. There's asking, and then there's asking. And then there's asking? No, there's just asking, and then there's asking. How do you not know that? Are you sure this is Donkey's Villa? Positive. Shh, here he comes. Remember, like we practiced. Nice day. Top of the morning. What a baby might say. Grab him. Ah! OK, so we got him. How are we going to convince him to actually go to the class? My claws are sharp. His face is pretty. We'll work it out. Sounds good. Rodent, don't speak after I speak. Just sit there and carry disease. Well, here goes. Uh, oh, thank God. It was hotter in there than free Tabasco night at a Ricky Martin concert. Why are you talking like that? Because I'm upset. I was about to pass out in there. Though your duct tape did just wax my mustache to a silky sheen. Thank you for that. Wait a minute. Are you donkey? If I were, would I be living behind a gas station with a Puerto Rican goat named Manuel? Enough of your riddles. Are you or are you not donkey? No, I am not donkey. I am, however, his more talented stunt double. And you have kidnapped the wrong jackass, jackass. What are we going to do now? I know this great after-hours club, but you kind of have to be skinny. I mean about kidnapping the wrong donkey. We have to be in Hunter's class in an hour. Ooh, that is a problem. Donkey's already on the set of his commercial. How could we have been so stupid? Although, to be fair, you do look exactly like donkey. Wait a second. If we couldn't tell the difference between Donkey and this guy... Then maybe they're related. I bet they got the same daddy! Oh, The kids won't know the difference either. We could just bring him to the class. Um, and why should I help you? How would you like to perform in front of a live audience? You can't talk, but you can dance, do stunts, and finally get that chance to be the star you were meant to be. I'll do it! 
Buddy hugs. Oh, I could just lose myself in your chest. Oh, where is that stunt donkey? Well, you better find him, because I ain't getting in that SUV, Ellen. Those things roll over. Consumer Reports, July 2004. Go on, check it out. You won't eat hot dogs again, either. Trust me. Man, where is that stunt donkey? If he's out there at that skinny club with that manual, I'm gonna be pissed. Better, yeah? Yeah, that festering boy on the face of our fair city is gone forever. Siegfried, our entire city owes you a debt of gratitude. Someone who loves you. You have saved Las Vegas. I did what I had to do. I'm just glad it's behind me. <gasps> You'll never find. Uh, I need to catch up with Lou Wars. I'll be back in an hour. Ooh. Kids, are you ready to meet Donkey? Yeah! yeah! Now, yeah! he's got laryngitis, so he can't speak, but he's real excited to be here. Please welcome the world-famous Hollywood movie sensation and my good friend, Donkey! And now I'm gonna do some of my scenes for y'all. Check it out. Andy, watch out for that temple of doom. Nothing my bullwhip can't handle, cause then it's the fight scene. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. Moving into little Beyonce. Baby boy, you stay on my mind. Fulfill my fantasies. Woo, yeah. You're not Donkey. You're an imposter. Hunter's dad is evil. He played with our dreams. <laughs> and now, I admit, he isn't the real Donkey. But this guy came here and tapped his little heart out. We live in troubled times. And there's a lot of bad stuff that can happen to any of us. But for a few moments, he helped us remember that there's still some good in this world. Boo! This sucks! You fat low, I just wet myself! Class dismissed, so we can all get over how lame that was. I'm sorry, buddy. I was really trying to help you out. Flaky drama queen, where is he? Jimmy! Your dad doesn't know Donkey. Your dad's a big fat liar. Cornhead, Cornhead, Brace face, Brace face, Brace face, Brace face. Okay, knock it off now. Don't take it out on Hunter. The truth is. Hi, everybody! <gasps> That's right, put your eyeballs back in your head. It's really me. It's him, Donkey! Yeah, yeah, well, donkey. see, I promised my buddy Larry I'd come and visit the class. But I thought I couldn't make it, so I sent my stunt double instead. Sorry for the confusion, Larry. No problem. Don't gay. Yeah, don't do that. Okay, kids, this has been a real treat for you, but I can't stay. Gotta get back to that commercial I'm shooting for the wonderful SUV. The new rock monster from Sundake, Mountain Rookout. <laughs> Yay, yes, Larry, Larry, you know what? You're crazy, but you're all right. Listen, the next time you're in L.A., I want you to come by my house and we'll shoot some poo, watch my big screen, and climb my rock wall. Thanks, that sounds great. Not gonna happen. Your people killed Mama Cass! She, she was a singer, choked on a ham sandwich. So you being friends with Donkey, that was just a lie? Yeah, I'm sorry. It's okay. Thanks, Dad. Guess you don't really know any celebrities, huh? That, uh, that's not true. I know Justin Timberlake. You know Justin Timberlake? Justin Timberlake! <laughs> Yeah, Jamise, uh, right. Yeah, you know, I liked a lot of what you did there, but I'm still not quite feeling my love for the rock monster. Like when those bowlers are hitting you, Donkey loves that. He don't feel no pain. And keep your eyes open. You're making me look all squinty. I think I broke my shin. Terrific. Let's do one more take for safety. Man, these shoots are exhausting. Oh! Oh, son of a...